sea is a powerful force. Deep blue water covers 70% of our planet's surface. For millennia, the ocean has been the source of inspiration for artists and of food for civilizations, and the fickle decider of life or death for those who dare venture into it. Now one company in Israel has found a way to harvest that force to create clean energy. Right now, the world is definitely not generating enough clean electricity. According to the United Nations, 60% of the greenhouse gas emissions in the world are currently derived by the way that we're producing electricity from fossil fuels such as oil, coal, gas, and so on. Only 20% of the world's electricity right now is being produced by clean energy sources. So the sources that we have, solar, wind, are amazing sources, but it's not enough. The technology is new, but simple. Floaters move up and down with the waves, and the power of those movements is then transformed into electricity that can be connected to the national grid. It's not just the waves that can create energy. The tides, the currents, and even the salt in the water can be converted into electricity that you can use in your own home every single day. These 10 floaters here are enough to power 100 households, and the goal is to power entire cities just with the use of water. Although the commercialization of wave energy is happening at a much faster pace than solar or wind, it still needs more funding and research. But the main challenge is legislation. Governments still lack the regulatory frameworks to implement wave power because it is such a new source. In order to install this power station, we did a detailed environmental survey proving that we have zero negative footprint on the environment. Remember that we don't connect the floaters to the seabed or to the ocean floor. We only connect to existent man-made structures. So we're taking this cement wall that is built to protect the port from storms and we turn it to a clean source of electricity. So we're actually using something that damaged the environment to turn it into something that's environmentally friendly. If fully harnessed, wave energy globally could meet the world's electricity needs, according to the World Economic Forum. Many countries are working on ways to develop ocean energy systems. Here in Israel, EcoWave Power is the first wave technology to be connected to the Israeli national electrical grid. By the end of April, households near the historic Jaffa port will be able to turn on their TVs and washing machines using the power of the waves they see right outside their windows.